Assalamu alaikum my brothers and sisters we are back with another video and today we are discussing the pillars of Islam now I plan on making this some sort of series so if you want to see it hit the like button let me know down in the comments I greatly appreciate it and let's get into it so the first pillar we're going to talk about is the I mean, the pillar I don't know how else you want me to put it it is like the pillar of pillars the most fundamental pillar that there is it is the Shahada or the declaration of faith if you don't know what the shahada is it's basically like let's say well use me for example in order to technically revert to islam you have to take the shahada which is saying there is no god but allah and muhammad is his messenger that's, that's basically it um and in arabic it's I, I don't know i don't speak arabic i'm learning though if anyone wants to help me that would be great because i suck at it the Shahada is basically the foundation of a Muslim's identity. So by reciting the Shahada with sincerity, one affirms their belief in oneness um, of Allah and the prophethood of Muhammad. Now we all know, or at least anyone that's returning knows that I am a revert, right? Still, still new. I'm like a, a year in, a little over a year now. So if I get anything wrong, you could please correct me. I don't think I'm getting anything wrong though. Um, but you know, I'm just here to help spread the message. You know what I mean? Anyways, let's get back to it. I just wanted to add that in there. So at least for me, for a while, I didn't realize I was saying the Shahada five times a day. I was praying, like I actually started praying a little before um, I technically took the Shahada, but I didn't realize that in every prayer I was, like I didn't know what the Shahada was, right? But in every prayer, at least I was saying, basically the shahada i was saying what's what's in english um let me think in english it's uh i bear witness that none has the right to be worshipped except allah and i bear witness that muhammad is a slave and messenger that's at least the one like how i was taught it so that's how i was doing it and i mean i still use it so i didn't realize i was saying it in every single prayer um i don't know if that's how actually i don't know if that's how you're supposed to do it like, I don't know if you should say the Shahada in every prayer. I feel like you should. But I didn't know that. So, like, if you're new and you didn't know that, now you know. Um, yeah, I, I, I just wanted to add that little detail in there. But I guess by doing that, that really pushes um, how firm you are on that belief. And, like, me saying it over and over again. I, like, I truly believe it, of course. Um, so, I think it's helped a lot at least getting me through uh any religious questions or anything like that but what i want to know is i want you guys to reflect on the shahada right tell me when you took it if you took it um how was it was it good was it bad whatever and what does it mean to you i want to know your stories down below in the comments this is a short video i'm not expecting it to be very long because, I mean, we're doing one, one pillar at a time. Um, but if you guys want to see more, maybe you want more information on the first pillar. Um, I'm still, like I said, I'm still learning a bunch of things. So if I left anything out, I apologize. If I got anything wrong, I apologize. Please correct me. And I think that's it. Uh, so anyways. Again, comment down below what you want. Not only what do you want me to do next, but... What I asked uh, was uh, how the Shahada has basically like helped shape your life or like reflect back onto it. Let me know your experience. I want to know. So comment down below that. Like the video. Subscribe so you don't miss a discussion or breakdown of the other pillars. Like I said, it's a little short video. It is what it is. If you want it longer, if you want a full like 10, 20 minute breakdown, I could do that. That's not a lot of time, but I could do that. Anyways, I love you guys. I'll see you later. Goodbye.